My name is Michelle Trotter. I'm a business development specialist here at Eagle. Health officials have instructed the public to practice social distancing, so here at Eagle, we've made some internal changes to help limit our employee interaction. Our lab is now open seven days a week, which will be beneficial to you because this will better our turnaround times and also increase our efficiency, so in return, you can serve your patients faster during these challenging times. Last week, the FDA issued an emergency use authorization to permit the use of hydroxychloroquine sulfate and chloroquine phosphate to help treat coronavirus patients. We asked Dr. David Husong, who's in Washington, D.C., on what he thinks about this emergency use authorization. The data on its efficacy are not complete at this time. FDA has had a long-standing policy of permitting, uh, sometimes they call it compassionate use of products that have um, evidence of uh, efficacy. Hydroxychloroquine is something that is hopeful, but it's not established yet. They're doing a, um, they being FDA, are, are doing an attempt at helping the best they can. And I think it's the smart thing to do is risk-based. Thank you to everybody who has sent us questions the past few weeks. If you have any questions or concerns that you would like us to answer, please fill out the form on our website. Stay tuned for another episode of Eagle TV this Friday as we talk to Dr. David Husong about the reuse of respiratory masks and much more.